Um, <laughs> this music is really intense. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um, hello! Welcome to the stream. Uh, today I want to play Coast and Quest. Um, I also put other, fu other fun things, just in case, just in case. Um, <clears throat> let's see, let's see. Um, mm, 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 mm. let me switch to the Coastone Quest layout. Oh, <laughs> hold on, hold on. Switching back. Now I can switch to it. Yeah, there we go. Oh gosh, what is this music? It's it's uh, Mario. Right? <laughs> yeah, 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 it totally is. <laughs> I was like, ah, oh, it feels so familiar, but what is it? <laughs> uh, my compress compressor isn't on. Let me turn that on. Um, it was on. <laughs> um. Apparently. Apparently. Apparently was on. Let's uh, start Coast on Coast already. <laughs> um, I'll see if I'll stream for the full two hours today. My stomach hurts a lot today. Mm. Oh, I forgot the stupid music. <laughs> Hold on. Let me, <laughs> let me turn the spooky music off. Oh my gosh. <laughs> music collision. <laughs> Let's play Coast and Quest again. You know, it looks really loud um, on stream end, but I also know that the title screen is pretty loud and it was kind of quiet when I um, listened back to like the last VOD to make sure. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna leave it. <clears throat> sorry, sorry. Uh, Maraqua. Yes. Let's go. Um, wow, I have a lot of balloons. <laughs> Playing this game on easy is an experience. Okay, the game does look pretty loud, but um, I think it'll be fine on me. Actually, the game is kind of loud on my end. <laughs> Can I change that here? I think so. Mm. There, just a little bit lower. Okay. Um, something happened today. Kind of interesting. Um, I got like my application for. Uh, Neopets Classic got a fruit today. 
Which, okay, I already forgot I even submitted an application, honestly. <laughs> so I've been exploring Neopets Classic a little bit. It feels so different from the site I'm used to. Um, not really in a good way, it's really like confusing. <laughs> Uh, you know, growing pains, I guess, um, and maybe just uh, something you have to get used to. Um, let's see. Of course, like all all the good names are are taken on the Opus Classic because it had that giant boom of users, and I mean, it's still the most active like Neopets. Uh, um, what's it called? Neopets uh, clone, I guess. <laughs> um, oops. <clears throat> so yeah, apparently there's like no way, no good way of earning money aside from um, dailies and random events and uh, the employment agency. So it's gonna be. Uh, it's probably going to be pretty rough for a while, because <laughs> I don't have any new points. <laughs> uh, let's see. No, frick. Nice, nice, nice. Oh right, the magic thing. Okay, so I need green or something? Ah, oh, there it goes. It ruined. <laughs> I wonder if there's like gameplay, like if there's like controls I don't know about. Mm. Like it would be great if you could switch the colors that you have, um, but I don't really know how that works. Uh oh, I don't want to lose this. Uh... <laughs> We're still playing on easy. <laughs> Why am I losing? No. Oh. Stressful. <laughs> Color glass. There were no yellow ones there. <laughs> no. <sighs> no. I'm waiting for this meat bit. Keep talking about Neopets Classic. Um, uh, let's see, let's see. So apparently, you can have site accounts on that site, which I'm not used to. Oops. Um, I don't know how to make site accounts. I don't know if you can do that right now. Like, there's a lot of stuff that like used to work a certain way, but no, not anymore. Because I guess it got exploited in some way, and they haven't like changed it yet. <laughs> and like a lot of the information is outdated, which I get it. I get it, especially since the community is like mostly on Discord. That um, the site and the, like the web resources uh, aren't up to date. Like I get it. Uh, I'll have to take a good look at the Discord, which I've been dreading a little bit because I've heard so many bad things about Neopets Classic um, and its Discord and its community. And, um, but you know, um, I'd love to be proven wrong. Like, I don't think it's as bad as people have been saying, really. Because all in all, we just want, like, we're just a bunch of adults, like, who want to play a fun little game with fun little animals, like, how evil can can the site be, really? Uh, <laughs> but I guess I'll find out. <laughs> um, it has a lot of, like, custom content. Um, I don't know if the people making the custom content, um, if they're getting, um, shit. Uh, 
what's the word, what's the word? Uh, reimbursed, like, if they get paid. They should be. Um, <laughs> because there's a lot of custom content, like there's entire colors, and like the art is really polished, it looks better than the, uh, than the like, official art. Um, there seems to be a lot of community-made stuff. Uh, making me a bit concerned about like um, if they're getting paid properly. Uh, I'm just assuming they are. <laughs> I mean, where else would that this like the um, Patreon money go? I guess. Um, so yes, lots of lots of. Well, it wasn't too bad. Um, lots of colors. And like there are custom items. And let's see. Apparently they had a plot yes uh, last year. I was about to say yesteryear, which I guess you can say that for a <laughs> Who the heck says yesteryear anyway? <laughs> it's cute though, more people should say. Actually, let's just start saying yesteryear on the stream. Yeah. Be the change you want in the world. <laughs> Start saying yes to here <laughs> more casually. The my, like all of my like favorite Neofets names were taken. Like Sorrow was taken. Sorrow, really? Sorrow, like the like the guy Sorrow with the the cape and the mask and the the. Um, what's that called? You know, fencing sort of thing. Shit, I don't know what it's called in English. <laughs> the fencing guy. Sorrow was taken. I'm so upset. Uh, Cause like my childhood pet was named Sorrow with six R's. Uh, I guess I could just remake Sorrow with six R's, but like. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I don't know how side accounts work. Uh, work. It. Um, let's see. Uh, Avatar seems kind of. Avatars seem kind of weird. Like the new work preferences don't work. You have to type that URL in manually, and the default avatars don't work. I don't know. Phew! I don't know if that did any good. Just use a pet pet. <laughs> um. So yeah, I don't think I'll put as much time and effort into my Neopets Classic account as I as I put into my uh, modern Neopets account that's the site I'm on. Um, I just- I like the idea of, of modern because it's it's the classic style of Neopets but it has new features that makes it uh, less of a pain and more fun. <laughs> Also, the economy makes more sense for the user base, and uh, Hazer, who's running it, um, changes things around uh, quite often to make it feel um, balanced. I need to not die on the stage. <laughs> so yeah, I love I love modern Neopets a lot. Um, that's my favorite place to be right now. Mm, no, I missed. <laughs> oh, there is one red fairy. <laughs> Excuse me, I mean fire fairy. Nice. Um, what else is there? What else is there? Still not playing regular Neopets, just out of principle. I. I don't want to. <laughs> but um, an interesting thing re uh, surfaced, not resurfaced, the surfaced on um, the Neopet subreddit. Someone found out that uh, NetDragon, who owns Jumpstarts, who owns Neopets, um, put, uh, they put all of their, um, like, Financial. <laughs> yeah, we're playing this again. They put all of their um, 
What's it called? Uh, money stuff. Uh, well, basically, they put. There was like a. Um, I can't think of the words. It's difficult words, because it's, it's like fini financial stuff, so I don't know what anything's called in English. Uh, <laughs> this is so stressful. Let's see, let's see. Uh, like, their earnings and plans for, like, their brands. And Neopets was part of, uh, like, the slides they had on that page. Um, like, a, a small part of it was dedicated to Neopets. And apparently, ne NetDragon has... Um, or rather, they think that they will hit big with the new Neopets Match 3 mobile game. And, um, I mean, anyone who's had any experience with Neopets and its mobile games knows that this game is gonna flop, and it's disappointing to see them, um, like, acting so optimistic about a game that no one in the fan base wants. <laughs> And no one outside of the fan base wants either. <laughs> I I can't imagine someone who like don't know what Neopets is like playing a Neopets match four game when there's like five million other match four games. But I don't know. That's just the way things are. NetDragon makes mobile games. Neopets is owned by NetDragon. So those are the Neopets news, I suppose. <laughs> Both personal Neopets news and uh, just general Neopets news. <laughs> mm. Hey, I didn't ask. Is the audio okay today? I did change the compressor, compressor settings a little bit because I felt like they were just way too harsh when I like listened back to some of the stuff. It's okay. Mm, I might have to like mess around with the compressor a bit on my own because uh, I don't know. I started like getting a headache when I was like listening to the audio. It's just, it, it's just it sounds kind of like rough. Um, <laughs> if audio had a texture, it would be like kind of coarse. <laughs> Like, it would be kind of neat, like, if it had, like, a neat outline, but then at the very edge, I had an, like, if it, if it was, like, a wooden table... Oh my god, my, my... <laughs> this is how my brain works. If, if my audio was a wooden table, then it would be a very neatly made table, but, um, someone did not sand the edges of the table. That's how I feel. I did watch a video about someone making tables yesterday. <laughs> Let's keep going. I want more baby fireballs. They're the best ones. Starfish Blender. I have a plan about the Venom movie. The new one. My plan is, I will wait for. I don't know. Since since is Disney, you know, since they own Marvel, the movie will probably be out in the theater for a long time. So I'm gonna wait, like I'm on, and then I might go see the movie because it's a small movie theater. In the past, when you know the pandemic wasn't a thing, I've gone to even premiere, like movie premieres, and um, was the only person in the entire locale. <laughs> so our movie theater is pretty dead, uh, especially if you wait a bit um, before watching the movie. So that's my plan. And I don't think that many people are like that excited about that. <laughs> it would be different if it was like 
Avengers Endgame all over again or something. <laughs> That's like the only times I ever see other people in the theater, like in the past. I haven't gotten now, obviously, for two years or whatever. Um, um, but the only time I ever saw like a bunch of people was like doing the big movies, like the ones that everyone wanted to see. Um, otherwise, pretty, pretty dead. But yeah, yeah, Venom. I've got a plan. I will go in a month or something, <laughs> and hopefully, I will be the only person there. <laughs> so, no, no, uh, no risk <laughs> of uh, of spreading disease. Hopefully. I mean, it's not just about me, because, like... Gotta stay mindful. And it's not worth getting freaking infected just because you want to see stupid venom. <laughs> God. <laughs> but I'll, I'll, I'll check it out. I'll go there in a month. I'll see if there's any people there. I won't, like, pay in advance. I'll just go there, see what it's like, see if there's a bunch of people there. If there's a lot of people, I won't go in. Uh, that's the plan. That's the plan. It's at night too, so... Uh, hopefully it'll be kind of dead and there won't be any kids. Because um, kids are dangerous nowadays. They're dangerous. <laughs> that's my venom plan. Very nice. We even got a magic bonus thing. <laughs> Color blast. I uh, I took a look at yesterday's stream a little bit because, like, after the stream, I felt like, oh wow, that was like the worst. <laughs> like that must have been so hard to watch. And yeah, kind of hard to watch, but it wasn't as bad as I made it out to be in my head. Like while I was playing. <laughs> And it wasn't doing, like, the worst at the card games. <laughs> but yeah, I might play- I might play Monster Pub on my own and maybe come back to it uh, a another time. Uh, when I've brushed up my sandwich skills a little <laughs> It's a really cute game and, like, card games are cozy. Uh, it's just a bit unfortunate that- <laughs> I got stuck. <laughs> like, I was stuck on the same, like, game forever. Let's clear this quickly. I've already forgotten the music. Fireball. Very nice. Yeah, I don't really know how the combos are supposed to... Like, the, 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 the magic? Yeah, the magic is called. How the magic is supposed to work in this game. <laughs> like, am I supposed to use discard colors to make combos? But then I don't get the bonus at the end for for accuracy, so... <laughs> I don't really... I don't really get it. I'm stupid. <laughs> No! Come back here! <laughs> I just wanna know what, you know, what the story is all about in this game. That's all all it is, really. That's the driving, uh, driving force. Is that right? That's what I wanna know! I wanna know what happens to, like, Balthazar and... Wurt and uh, the fairies. Oh, fuck. I'm curious. I am. Okay. Very good, very good, very nice. Yeah. <laughs> what if I did like a Suma boot camp and then came back to this and played it on, on hard or whatever? <laughs> a month of Suma or something. Awful thing. Welcome to day one of Suma Boot Camp. Today, we are learning about X technique. 
Is that even worth it? <laughs> worth it? <laughs> Probably not. Ooh, money! I gotta say, Wart is pretty uh, money hungry. Let me drink a little bit. We got a max combo of eight. So close! So close. Mmm, more fireball! <laughs> more lives. I wanna get 99 lives. Oh, you can get over 100. Okay. <laughs> Hermit's home. <laughs> Me! I'm just like playing. It's okay. We don't need them. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> My brain is like uh, going a bit fast today. I need to remember to actually look at. Um, oops. Not that. <laughs> I need to remember to actually look at um, stream and see if things look good because sometimes I forget and uh, we get um, streams like the last Wilma's Warehouse stream where I had like <laughs> the corner of a window. No, not really, but like the the border rather of the window of the game was like on stream the entire stream I, I mean that's the kind of thing you just kind of forget about after a while even while watching but um, gosh it looked really bad <laughs> let's fireball them i'm looking a little bit at stream right now it looks fine to me I mean, this game is kind of easy to, uh, to capture because uh, I'm playing it in full screen and old, and I'm just capturing the screen. I'm not even capturing the game as its own thing. <laughs> so that's kind of easy. I think that's the honestly the easiest thing you can do is just capture your screen. You just need to make sure that you don't put anything else on it <laughs> on top of the game. Very nice. So yeah, we'll see. Uh, right now I feel I feel kind of okay. My stomach was hurting a bit. Um, it's fine right now, honestly. But if it starts hurting more, I'll uh, I'll stop early. Oop! No! No! <laughs> no! No! <sighs> I don't care if it nets me more points, kinda. I just want this to end because I want to see the plot. Oh, the plot. That's the goal here. It's ah, shit. <laughs> We're getting, um, uh, what's it called? We're getting, um, pincered. You know, like the, the tactical. It's a pincer attack! <laughs> there we go. Mm. There it is. Ooh. Very nice. <laughs> Almost sounded like the stupid gnome. <laughs> oh. I can't do it. <laughs> I want to bonk the stream so bad just for the fuck of it. <laughs> Maybe I can I can do it real fast. Fuck! I forget it exists. <laughs> the game <laughs> worth it. Space bar. <laughs> so worth it. You gotta you gotta oh. Um, Gotta keep the stream entertaining somehow. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm 
No, my head hurts. I laughed too hard. <laughs> mm, what was the other thing? I want to watch the Paw Patrol movie. But I know that one's uh, <clears throat> available online. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, I'm gonna have a movie night. Um, what is there? Uh, let's see, let's see. I was used for fun. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, totally. Uh, <laughs> everyone's favorite thing is net locks. Um. A Bamason video? Where's the- oh, the blue is at the end. <laughs> Look at Balthazar is super little. <laughs> like crouching, like pushing them as hard as he can. He kind of looks like he got shrunk, you know, but we're used far off. Um, <laughs> like imagine this tiny little Balthazar. Uh, let's see. Uh, right, right, I've been- it's for the fuck of it, I looked at what you need to do in order to like start a club, like in real life. Because it was like, hey, wouldn't it be cool if we had like a stargazing club or like a space club in our town? But uh, eh, you need at least three people. <laughs> and I don't have at least three people. <laughs> Also, you need like a proper goal and everything. I don't know what our goal would be. Maybe, uh... <laughs> I don't know. What would you do in a stargazing club? <laughs> I would let you join. I would do. We could do like. Um... <laughs> we would um, have like a live stream, yeah? So the club would have a site where we also like live stream every meeting. So that we could have international club members. Wouldn't that be neat? And then you could stargaze. Like we would put uh, the the stream. Like there is an observatory, yeah. Um, not in our town, but uh, it's not that far away. Um, so if we had any meetings at the observatory, maybe there is a way to hook up the computer um, or a computer to the observatories. Um, telescope, if it's one of the high-tech ones, and then we could maybe stream that. I don't know. Wouldn't that be neat, though? Wouldn't that be neat? <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> Sorry. I don't have enough members. Sad face. <laughs> I also don't know how to run a club. <laughs> First thing for everything, though. Hmm. <laughs> I know how to run clubs at DeviantArt, that's something. <laughs> totally the same thing, totally. <laughs> Lots of real life like applications uh, for that knowledge. <laughs> you know what we should have in this tiny ass town? Furry club! Oh yes! Oh, it would be so funny. Imagine just uh, I mean, it's, it's a thing. Or rather, I guess meetups are more of a thing than an actual club. <laughs> Furry club! That was my... Uh, <laughs> air horn. <laughs> what would a furry club be like? Like, you would have to put down, you know... Uh, it, you would have to have those uh, fancy rules. And you would also have to have a goal. What would the goal of a furry club be? Maybe like um, the goal is to inform like the general public of like what furries are and like the history of the fandom. <laughs> but it could also like um, it doesn't have to be like strictly like fur like we could also like use it as a guise to inform people. Uh, about, uh, you know, alternate lifestyles and, uh, community 
and acceptance, you know? Because that's like the pillar stones of the furry community. Kind of, kind of, kind of. If you look too far back into the history of the furry fandom, uh, it's basically just porn. Um. <laughs> it, it's true. I'm. I will not pretend that that isn't the truth. <laughs> no, but like it started. Can we do like furry history talk? Because that's really fun. So like... Um, if I remember correctly from like... Uh, there's a Down the Rabbit Hole video about furry fandom by Fred Newton. And in that video... He talks about how the furry fandom started off as signs. Because it was called the furry... No, uh, funny... Funny cartoon animals or whatever it is. <laughs> Like the like the kind of humanoid characters you saw in like Disney cartoons and the like, like uh, what's the word uh, name rather of the uh, like tailspin you know stuff like that, but uh, maybe not as recent as tailspin, uh, anthropomorphic Disney characters stuff like that. So they made signs because signs was a big deal. And they sent them out, and then eventually they had meetups that was like funny cartoon animal meetups. So like it did like it's just the si those signs were pretty raunchy, I think, because it was like you know adult versions of like the, the like they drew like the cartoon characters in interesting um, scenarios. <laughs> And then they had meetups at like regular like cons and stuff for like other like nerd stuff. And then it like evolved from there, I think. Yeah. I think that's like basically the history of the furry fandom. They also like I think they have some kind of correlation to like the early like anime fandom. Cause um uh, anime fandom was kinda like the same thing where they sent out um like before anime got licensed in other licensed in other countries, uh, people imported like VHSs and the like from Japan and hard subbed them and sent them out to uh, other members of the fandom. So it kind of and there's some kind of overlap there that I don't remember uh, really what happened, but somehow there's an overlap between. Oh, an achievement! Between the furry fandom and anime. Uh, but yeah, I think that's, that's pretty much all I remember from like early furry fandom uh, trivia. <laughs> I think that's how it started. But then it like quickly got like a whole lot more wholesome. <laughs> Thankfully. <laughs> I need to drink. Can I do this while I... No, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. <laughs> I don't wanna spill my drink all over the table. <laughs> Is this... Yeah, it's Balthasar. Okay, it's fine. I can hold out. I still have never <laughs> been to a furry con. Uh, I did buy tickets to one and I was too scared to go in. <laughs> I traveled for like a day. I got there. I've already talked about this, I think. I got there. I was too scared to go in. I went home. <laughs> there were like guys outside and I was nervous. They were like standing there smoking by the entrance and I got so nervous and I just cried and went home. <laughs> I'm gonna drink. <laughs> it's so stupid. I traveled across the country to get there. <laughs> oh, oh, plot. <sighs> okay, let's uh, calm down. <laughs> it's just plot, Jojo. Bella says, "Good job. Uh, you managed to save all those fairies despite being underwater. I'm impressed." Yeah, it's 
a good thing I had the seaweed necklace you gave me. Why did the- why did like a dark fairy give us the, the seaweed necklace anyway? Shouldn't it have been a water fairy? <laughs> I don't know what I would have done without it. Now, uh, where did Balthazar head off to this time? That's it? <laughs> Woohoo! We completed Maracqua! Oh! We got another, like, way too detailed code stone. What's the next one? Ooh, it's Mystery Island. And we got two of the Battle Fairy? There's only supposed to be one. <laughs> that looks, like, exactly like that. Ooh, Mystery Island. How mysterious. Yes, <laughs> it should be quite an adventure. Hurry along now and get ready to free those fairies. I'm going as fast as I can. God, Rayla. Oh, you don't get it. You don't get how hard it is to be wart. Why do I even do that? <laughs> this. This is the background to the stream, this screen, because it's the first one I found on, like, when I googled the game. <laughs> uh. Nice, very nice. Oops, that's not very nice. <laughs> um, I can continue with some more convention talk, because I've been to a whole bunch of anime conventions. That's my, like, safe ground. <laughs> uh, but I've also had, like, moments at anime conventions where I started crying and went home. <laughs> also school. <laughs> has also happened when I tried going to school. <laughs> new school year. New day of crying and going home. <laughs> I think it was, like, the, the one of the first days of university. Oh, what is this? We have an aim- like aiming reticle thing now? Wow. What magic is this? <laughs> like in-game magic? Oh, it's gone. Yeah, I went to school- well, university. And I couldn't find the right building. <laughs> and I didn't know what to do. <laughs> they started crying. They called my uh- I think I called my dad. And I was like, I'm lost! Can I go home? And it was like, no! So then they called the teacher, and the teacher was like, What? Oh, yeah, I'll just stand outside of the building. <laughs> so then I found the right building. But it was all for naught anyway, because I, I got sick like one week in and I could not go for like two weeks and then I was so far behind that I just decided to drop out of that one course. So it was all for naught. <laughs> that was like, I think it was like graphic design or something, so it was, it was something I wasn't interested in. <laughs> so I wasn't, <laughs> like, I, I did not, like, I could not cope with like, um, Catching up with all the stuff I missed, it was just too much. On top of like other courses I also took at the same time. <sighs> but that's university for you. I'm waiting. <laughs> no, I'm just looking at the Meepit again because it's so cute. I get distracted. <laughs> I love it so much. It's so cute. There we go. Whew. Taking a little break from talking for a few seconds. <laughs> Just kind of nice, honestly. Let's have a quiet moment. Sometimes you just need a quiet moment. Oh, the magic. Fuck. Blue color blast would have been the best. I've been thinking about how, um, like, uh, how do I? 
How do I freeze this? It's nothing weird. Like, uh, mm -mm -mm. very quickly losing my train of thought. <laughs> Uh, what was it? What was it? Oh, fuck, no. Baby Fireball, help. Nice. <laughs> well, basically, I've been thinking about the stream, and I was wondering if I should, like, um, maybe, like, try, like, squeezing in, like, uh, like, a more relevant game, like, a more popular game, I guess, that I also like. At the same time, I'm not I'm not streaming to get like views, <laughs> so it's it's not really like I don't have to worry about that. But things like Minecraft <laughs> is are, are Minecraft streams popular? I feel like there must be so many of them. <laughs> So true. I have been streaming Minecraft on and off, but now since I, I there's a server I'm on that's the it's like it's the modern Neopets Minecraft server. And I've been playing on that. My friend has also been on there. And I don't know if I can stream that. <laughs> but I could go back to my single player Minecraft file. Uh, since the last time I streamed Minecraft I had frame drops. Um, oops, what happened there? I thought it was yellow for some reason. Um, so the stream didn't turn out that well. Nope, what am I doing? <laughs> um, is it just me or is this stage like super easy? Is it because we switched lands and they want us to have some time to... Uh, um, look at the art. <laughs> Taking the sights of Mystery Island. Fuck. Fireball. Fuck. Um, what was it? I was talking about Minecraft? Yeah. Um, I could ask if it's okay for me to stream uh, me building stuff on the server. I don't. I don't think it would be a problem. And it's not like I'm gonna show like the. I don't even think you can join the server, even if you had like the uh, the right address, because you need to get um, whitelisted. So there wouldn't be any like security issues. So I don't think it would be a problem to stream me just building something. Um, but you know, I can't. I can't like have people like consent to. Like if they're in chat or anything, I can't. I can't just ask them. Like, oh hi, I'm streaming. Is that okay? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay though. Like this this time of the day, I'm usually the only one playing, so maybe uh, I could ask. I could ask if I could play on the server, maybe. <laughs> More fireballs, please. Oh, that's haunting. Ooh, I kind of like that they go inside though. That's kind of interesting. <laughs> also, we have two. Woohoo! No! <laughs> Damn it! Kind of feel like talking about movies again now. <laughs> there are some movies that. I want to watch but haven't gotten around to. Like, uh, The Lighthouse is one. I'm just. No. I've been a bit. Uh, I've been avoiding, like. I mean, I guess I'm always like that, but I try to avoid movies with, like, a lot of, like, raunchy parts in them. Because it makes me really uncomfortable. <laughs> what is. Oh no, wait! Hold on, hold on! I need to mute the mic.
Okay, okay. Back to the game. <laughs> Sorry, it was like uh, completely quiet for me. Because <laughs> the music stops too. <laughs> Uh, what was it? The movies? Right, right, uh, Lighthouse. Yeah, I wanna watch Lighthouse. Cause I do love- I do love when, um... We can get something a bit different, but also... Kinda high budget, I guess? <laughs> and I wanna watch... I've never watched the original The Thing, so I wanna watch that and like the remake. Because I want to see the dog actor, because that, that really excited me. <laughs> uh, what else is there? Uh, hmm. I still haven't watched uh, the animation studio that did um, the animated wo movie about wolves and people turn into wolves. <laughs> <laughs> what is it called? What is it called? Damn it! Come out of there! Wolf walkers, maybe. Is that what it was called? Maybe. <laughs> I need to watch that and the rest of their movies because I, I haven't watched a single one of their movies and I feel bad about it because, you know, animation and all that. <laughs> There's also some like Swedish, like, uh, animated movies. What was that? There's a 3D animated Swedish movie. I think there's two actually. But one of them was actually animated in Sweden, the other one I think was just completely outsourced. I wanna watch those. Especially the one that was animated in Sweden, because that's really interesting. <laughs> we do like we do have some 3D animation studios in Sweden. I know the people that make Ninjago. Um, they make some of it in Sweden. I think like yeah, a bunch of like Lego ads are made in Sweden. I think that's that's a place I would like to work at. <laughs> but ask them about internships. Hmm. <laughs> I have a hard time, like, understanding where the threshold is for, like, the stress music on the stage. <laughs> Apparently when it goes inside the thing, it's, it's uh, close enough to be stressful. <laughs> uh... <laughs> My side hurts a little bit. It just happens on and off, it's fine. <laughs> Oh no! I had this operation a while back. You know, it hurts sometimes. Stop stressing me out with the music. Of course, it goes in the thing, so I can't even. <laughs> I can't even get to it. <sighs> Okay, we've been playing for about an hour. Okay, let's get this. There we go. And now that it's gonna start up again as soon as we get like up here. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> this, the game is starting to become more predictable. <laughs> I wonder if you can hear that, like. Crackle sound. It's like, you know how like walls make sound sometimes because they're settling. Uh, sometimes like my my computer, my monitors also do that. Sometimes my monitors settle. No, no, that was yellow. <laughs> uh. <laughs> and there comes Balthazar, I think. Here comes the wolf. Da -da -da -da. Here comes the wolf, and I say it's all right. No, why? 
Hello, <laughs> Blast. There's a blue one in here somewhere. Or not? No, it's in there. It's in there. <laughs> now he's gonna wait for Balthasar to come out. That sounds gay. <laughs> Woohoo! Yay! Oh, more baby. Oh, we didn't use one. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Little house. Beach hut. Oh, you know what this reminds me of? Um, the house kind of reminds me of... Um, well, there's this Swedish... No, no, what am I saying? There's a Danish um, book, like children's book series, which is called Rasmus Klopp. And we also have uh, the like Swedish translated versions of those books. And those books, aside from having an animated TV show, also had a game. And that is what this little house reminds me of. The houses in that game. <laughs> it's a really strange but kind of fun game. It's like basically just a bunch of fetch, fetch quests and mini games, but it's really cozy. I like it. It's funny how, like in Danish, he's called Rasmus Klump, but in Swedish, it's uh, Rasmus Nalle, which is the Swedish word for teddy bear, because he's a bear. <laughs> so we just completely like ignore the clump part. <laughs> That's some, uh, I guess, Danish cartoon trivia for you. <laughs> I used to watch... Um, there was a fi Finnish Swedish animated show. It was stop motion. I used to watch it all the time as a kid. It's kind of like... It, it was kind of scary though. Like, it was really cozy, but at the same time kind of haunting. Because like, there was a lot of like... Um, strange usage of... Dull... Dull... Um, body parts. <laughs> like... There was, and there was a lot of like exchanges of body part parts. Like there was like an entire episode that um, was all about how one of the bears lost his nose, and then they had to find a new nose. Like it was nothing like <laughs> it was nothing like weird or, or gory. Really, it was just like you know cartoony, kind of cute. But <laughs> they tried out a bunch of different noses. Uh, until we found one he liked, um, which was his original nose. Um, but the doll part thing was from a different episode where they run, ran a restaurant and some of the guests were like... like dolls? Like... Uh, but they were like mashed together like in Toy Story? <laughs> It was strange. I think there was like something that was just a pair of legs. <laughs> but still kind of like I don't I don't think it was meant to be scary. It was just weird. I think it was supposed to be in like a nightmare sequence or just a dream sequence. <laughs> it's kind of hard to remember, but I think some of it is on YouTube. I don't remember what it was called in Finnish though. I don't think there's I don't think the Swedish version was on YouTube. Because there was both the Swedish version and the Finnish version. Shh, damn it! You know what? I could have a break uh, in a bit and we could, like, watch some videos. Like, have a little watch, watch along, watch together. Wouldn't that be neat? 
<laughs> I do really love that when streamers do that. <laughs> oh, Moomin? Like, we have those too, like, you know, the Swedish dub version. <laughs> And the like the original. Um. Yeah, movements are like all over the place over here. So I have like a bunch of books and I have the comics and everything. <laughs> the one thing I really loved about them as a kid was the PC games. Yeah, a lot of movement PC games. <laughs> and that's like everyone had them too, because like I remember going over to friend's house. Houses and uh, like <laughs> every single person had at least one of the Moomin PC games. <laughs> I don't remember them being very good though. That fairy's scary. I guess that's the one that gives you the power up? I don't really get it. <laughs> Damn it, fuck! Focus for one second. Fuck. I was not focusing. I don't see any red! <laughs> that was satisfying. Ah. Okie dokie. Oops. But, um... Thing is, if I want to, like, um... Like, screen share YouTube, um... I'm scared the audio levels would get weird. So I have the, uh, Streamlabs has the... What? What's that called? There's the thing, you know, where you do donate money and, like... It plays a video or whatever, like a few seconds of video. It has that. I wonder if you can set that up so you don't have to pay. <laughs> oh, media share it's called. Yes, media share. I got the super power thing on the, at the end. I think. <laughs> That's not satisfying. Let me see if I can. Since um the game is gonna be quiet right at this moment. Let me exit and see if I can pull up the bears. Wouldn't that be neat? Oh, there's a movie. Okay, I want to try I want to try playing this. This is this is the these are the bears. So this is the Swedish intro. Let's see if this works. You can you can tell that it has like some like you understand where I like where I'm coming from when I say like some of it is kind of creepy. Like they have like realistic feet and like weird masks. I don't know. I just don't want it to be too loud. Oh, this is really low. Wow, well, it's really low. <laughs> Let me boost it. <laughs> it is kind of scary if you look at But I love the show. Oh yeah, that's scary. <laughs> <laughs> so the audio was so low, but you know, let's use that sometimes. Let's use the this um, Shadow at Noon video to level the audio. <laughs> yeah, you could easily turn Urpo and Torpo into a creepy pasta, probably. That good? No, it's a bit low. 
that? We'll see. We'll see with the game. The game is kind of loud. Wait, no, this is gonna be way too loud actually. Wait, hold on. This is the stupid part about the... I've already complained about like full, sc full screen games and <laughs> streaming. <laughs> oh, spacebar, yes. Ooh, that already like went a bit... Hmm. It doesn't look too bad. You, you just let me know if it's like too loud. <clears throat> I, um, uh, just speaking of like, you know, um, <laughs> like filtering things to look certain ways, I wanna, um, I wanna get the hang of doing, uh, you know, the old school, uh, effects on like arch properly to make like, you know, the people used to make like fake screenshots and stuff like that. I want to get a hang of that because uh, I would like to love to try to make just some fake cartoon screenshots just for fun because I think it would be really neat and cute. <laughs> and if someone made like really awesome uh, like Animal Crossing fan art that looked like an old cartoon, and I keep thinking about that, it was like the art style they used was like really. Uh, it was like kind of like regular sky style. Oh god, regular show esque style. <laughs> Look really cute. Yeah, old like hard coded uh, yellow subtitles. <laughs> Fun times. With his little eyes. Fuck. <laughs> I noticed like the second I like stop talking for a bit and my face relaxes because I just keep, <laughs> I just keep smiling every time I talk on stream. <laughs> and then my, then my face is like overdone. <laughs> and it goes back to, to you know, resting. <laughs> you can immediately feel the difference. It's the same when I like talk to my friends and everything. <laughs> You know, I, um, when I'm screaming or talking to my friends, my temperature just skyrockets. <laughs> That's the thing I have to, like, keep track of, like, honestly. <laughs> uh, it was, like, sometimes it's a problem because when, this is gonna sound completely random, but when Splatoon came out on the Wii U, I loved that game so much. And I, I love playing the Splatfest. But I was just so excited about it <laughs> that I kept having fevers while playing it. Like I started playing it and then I had to stop because I get a fever and I had to go lie down. <laughs> because I get too excited about Splatoon. So every Splatfest <laughs> I can only play for like an hour. Cause like, I got so excited and then I had to go lay down. <laughs> and now Split 2 3 is coming up. <laughs> it's gonna happen all over again. <laughs> Maybe I can stream Split 2 and, um, 3. <laughs> I can stream some of the um, single player ones. I don't know. I sent my capture card to my friend, so I don't have it right now. Otherwise I would, uh, I could do like a test stream. But, I mean, it's gonna take a while for Splatoon 3 to come out. What's the, uh... Yes, the, the ah, I get it, yes, 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 the, 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 like, the laugh energy, yes, 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 it took me a second. I, like, forgot. <laughs> I forgot the ending to that movie. Did you know they made a uh, Monsters Inc. 
like a new Monster Inc. cartoon that's on like Disney Plus or something. It's all about like new Monster Inc. like recruits. Like what's it called? Maybe they're interns? No, no, I think they just started working there. I know I haven't watched it. <laughs> I've only seen a few like screenshots. Just have some new monster designs. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I don't know what it's about, honestly. No. <laughs> If you follow that trail of thought, though, uh, new Disney cartoons, yeah? Have you watched any of like the Disney's latest, like, uh, you know, like Amphibia and, and uh, Owl House? I love Owl House. I know some other cartoons, but I don't think they're Disney. Uh, I think it might be Cartoon Network that's doing uh, Middlemost Toast by uh, the same guy that worked on Dexter's Lab and everything. Uh, is he Craig? It could be Craig. Craig McCartney? No, I don't know. It's one of the people, like the oldie, oldie Cartoon Network guys. Is working on the most post, uh, and that's airing right now. I watched a few episodes of the most post. It's uh, it's cute. It is a bit like Uncle Grandpa esque, though. It has like a lot of like randomness to it, which isn't really my cup of tea. But you know, uh, at least the art style is consistent. So <laughs> it doesn't mix art styles like a lot of cartoons did for a while. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Baby fire ball. <laughs> no! <laughs> God dang it! Okay, we're good. Aw, oh, new achievement! Oh, did you like something again? <laughs> Oh, cool! <laughs> Every time I think, like, for a second I think, like, oh no, did, like, did you get filtered? Did you try to say fuck and got filtered? But no, it's just the link. <laughs> Hold on. What's it good? What's it good? It's fine since we were just in, like, the between stages space. I didn't even pull up my stream today. <laughs> I don't have Twitch up today. <laughs> Hold on, hold on. Is uh, sending my way. Yeah, we probably have done that already. <laughs> ah, okay. Does this have audio? Let me pull it up here. Can you see this? Oh, yes. Oh, you animated the model! Oh, they're playing the hurdy gurdy. Oh, that's so great, and the owl is, is reading. Yes. Yeah, this looks great. Yeah, it's a great start so far. Like the the uh, what's it called? The hand motion looks really good. Hurdy girding. <laughs> yeah, you know, like um. Just from from an animation perspective, it needs some some more work in some places. But you know, it's a work in progress, so like I can't judge. <laughs> I never well. Do you know if, like the program we can make you dance? That's the only like experience that I have with the three <laughs> D <3D> animation. <laughs> it's the one where you, you can animate the Vocaloid models and the like. Hence why it's called Miku Miku Dance. <laughs> I used to uh, be a Miku Miku Dance fan as a teen, like early teen. Anyway, it's, it's a really good start. Like you got the bounce right too with the leg, that's really good. Yeah, it looks really good. Yeah, yeah, I keep working at that. It looks really great. 
you have my you have my uh, my blessing as a as an esteemed animation student. <laughs> Fuck what? <laughs> Why did it exit? <laughs> Space bar. <laughs> Mmm. Sound effects overload. <laughs> Let me drink too. Mm. <sighs> that gamer Pepsi. Mm. Witch doctor. <laughs> I don't know. I don't do we have a We have witches, we have doctors. <laughs> Was I talking about anything interesting before? Uh... Right, the cartoons. Um, They finished up. Was it season two of Owl House? Uh, really good, really good. I really enjoyed Owl House. It has some like parts to it that I'm not the biggest fan of, and like my friend agrees um, on a lot of the same points I have. Um, we both think that um, it wasn't enough. Um, well, I don't want to spoil anything actually. I don't want to spoil Owl House because it's 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 a really good show. <laughs> But there's yet another uh, like bully character that gets redeemed, and I've already talked about how I don't really like that. Um, and I don't feel like they put enough time into um, like redeeming them. So I would like some like I don't know. I don't feel I don't feel like their like apology to their bully victim was like enough. I don't know. And then the the show just kind of forgot about it, you know. They want to move on to like the bigger plot, and I get it. I get it. I get it because it's an interesting plot. But yeah, it does like rub me the wrong way a little bit. <laughs> but that's the only grievance I have with All House. Like the rest is just I love. I love the show. It's great. Fuck really? <laughs> really? <laughs> Can I do it? No. No, I can't. <laughs> I wish to knew my little pony movie that came out a while ago. I say a while, but it was just a few weeks ago. It was, uh... It was, like, visually it was awesome. Like, it looked really good. It was animated really well. Um, they did a really good job with the visuals, but uh, since everything is outsourced to China, um, the, they didn't do um, the lip syncing correctly. So it feels kind of strange. Something like the, the lines don't match up with the mouse. Um, oops. So that kind of like makes the movie feel cheaper than it is. Why did that get stuck there? Do I have to hit it? <laughs> Probably. So if I hit it with yellow, will it delete the yellow ones? No, it will just explode. <laughs> yeah, the, my, the new My Little Pony movie it has some strange parts, which I don't want to spoil. But uh, I guess we'll see what they do with the Why wouldn't they make a cartoon? <laughs> I'll watch it, I'll watch it. Uh... Oops, I needed that. <laughs> back here. <laughs> One extra for the trees. 
Remembered, uh, Mob Psycho Season 2, no, Season 3? What is this? No, Mob Psycho 2? The new season of Mob Psycho is coming out. Or is out? I don't know, I got an email about it. Uh, but I didn't look at it. <laughs> so I might be watching that. Um, no, I'm of course not gonna spoil any of the episodes. Uh, I'll stream or anything. <laughs> If I do watch them. Because I really like that's a really good anime. I liked it a lot more than One Punch Man, personally. Because um. they're made by the same guy. Uh. <laughs> so we might have some more anime talks on the stream. <laughs> Maybe. It's a possibility. It's a possibility. I'm not like super stoked about like getting into like anime again. <laughs> I've been so like uh, excited about like more western like cartoons the last couple of years. I have watched Nichijo, it's one of the best animes ever. And the manga is funny too, but like the anime just it works so well as an anime. <laughs> It's perfect, isn't it? Oh, if they did more in Nichijo somehow, that would be the day. That would be so good, yes! <laughs> so good! Do you have a favorite Nichijo character? <laughs> I don't know if I remember the names though, they all have pretty simple names. No, I, I can't really remember. I remember Hakase and Namo, but... Uh... Oh no, I haven't watched that one yet. I have it downloaded though. It was like, kind of like the... An anime I thought I might <laughs> like. Um, but it was during the period where I didn't want to watch any anime. Yeah, I might give it a, I might give it a watch, especially if someone recommends it, you know? I'm like a sucker for recommendations. Like, if someone's like... Um, I watched this movie, it was alright. I'm just like, what movie? <laughs> Can I watch it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is an interesting one. But yeah, I'll, I'll have to... I'll, uh, it's good since I already have it. So I could just uh, like pull it up and watch it. Maybe. There's no maybe. Or perhaps. At least you have, you must. No negotiate negotiation. <laughs> it's a it's a live voice acting of of your lines. Yep. I'll give it a watch. Yeah, yeah. I'll watch. I'll I'll uh, as soon as I can. I'll grab a note and I'll write hands off on it. And then I'll remember to watch it later. <laughs> or at least watch the first episode. <laughs> oh, fuck. My eyes. <laughs> Sorry, my eyes are uh, going all over the place. Uh oh. <laughs> Might have to call Twitch now. Sorry. No harassment in this chat. Hello, young Twitch? I need help. <laughs> My viewer is being very aggressive. <laughs> Mr. Twitch, please. I need your help. <laughs> My singular viewer is being mean to me. And I want you. To kick them off my shadow. Please and thank you. Mwah. Thank you, thank 
Apparently it's a, it's a, it's a letter now and not a phone call. <laughs> I guess you could say how to kiss is in a phone call. Never mind. Oh, what did I say before? Uh, yesteryear. Yes, we need to start using yesteryear more. Normalize yesteryear. Dear Mr. Amazon, please give me all of your life's earnings. I will use it to cure world hunger. Thank you. And end world hunger. I thought that felt uh, strange. <laughs> No, <laughs> it's so hard to aim. Oh my god. Okay, how does how will the baby fireball go? Okay, it, it did work. I forgot the other music existed for a second. <laughs> this game is just it, the soundtrack for the stage is just the stress music. <laughs> I still have a hard time with the ma- I don't know how the magic works still, I've been playing this for a while now and I still don't know. <laughs> like, I get the meter, I get it, I get that the meter fills up, and I get that you have this on the side here, this is magic, and when you get certain things in certain orders, you get the magic spells, you use the spells, clear the bottles, blah blah blah. I still don't get it. It's like being in school. I just don't understand anything. The, the stress music is still here. <laughs> mm. Apparently there's some uh, croissants waiting for me in the kitchen. <laughs> I'm uh, honestly very, very excited about that. <laughs> I love them, I love croissants. It's just, you know, I'm sure, like, <laughs> I'm sure they're uh, maybe not that special if you, I, I, I honestly don't know. I just know that, you know, French breakfast and all that, croissants are really common, but um, they're a bit of a rarity over here, like, some bakeries make them, and that means that some grocery stores buy them. You have to get them early, obviously, because otherwise they'll get all icky. Get them early in the morning. And uh, what else is there? They always just they <laughs> they just make croissants with chocolate. I like to use the normal ones better, but it's always use the chocolate ones. They like they only only ever have the chocolate ones in, at the supermarket. Go! Yes. We're doing it. Go! There we go. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> You know, you know what I want to play right now? Wii Sports. I want to play Wii Sports. I want to play um, the bowling game. And uh, tennis. The classic tennis. 
Could you imagine if you could play Wii Sports uh, Tennis uh, online? <laughs> Wouldn't that be so great? Wii Sports Online Collection. Get it now with the Nintendo Switch Online. Die, Balthazar! Ha ha ha! Very nice. <laughs> Wii, Sports, Wii Sports Tennis is so good. That's the classic. And then like the second the second best one is like bowling, maybe. Oops, sorry. <laughs> that was my coaster, it got stuck. Does the real mountain have a kachik face on it? On the opus? A volcano? Wait. Oh, I want to investigate it, but then it will close out of the game. It's not really worth it. <laughs> I just noticed the real- Oh my god, it's right there! <laughs> I thought it just had this face. It's like techo, zombie, whatever it is. It probably has all three, because why would they lie? Put Neo Pest Coast on Quest. Why? You think they do that? Go on the internet and tell lies? <laughs> Have you watched Arthur? It's my favorite cartoon. What's the- there's one line in Japanese in Arthur. <laughs> it's uh, Osamu Tezuka is the king of manga. Buster says it. Osamu Tezuka- Os- no, fuck, I forgot the name immediately. Osamu Tezuka la! Manga no Tamatamadis. Okay, it sounded really like uh, <laughs> stiff when he said it. And not very um, natural. <laughs> Thanks, Yo Yo. That's what stiff means. <laughs> no! Ah! Uh, I should, um, you know, I've spoken English on this stream. I've spoken. Wait, have I spoken Swedish on the stream? Let's just pretend I have. But I haven't heard a lot of Japanese on the stream yet. Hmm. I have to flex those Japanese brain muscles. Hmm. Yeah, like, come on. Throw me a bone here. I only know three languages. <laughs> and one of them is only the uh, lowest possible level. <laughs> I mean, yatta! <laughs> Dicta! Yosh! Ikso! Kakui daro! That's good enough of that. I already feel embarrassed. <laughs> I don't think it was too bad. <laughs> I know, one of the first things we learned in Japanese class was learning how to say My Japanese is a bit uh basically, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, did you see that? That was impressive. And completely accidental. <laughs> This is going really well for some reason. Guess this stage is a bit easy. There's not a lot of things they can hide behind on this one. Pew! 
Neopets is available in Japanese. Uh, it's like Japanese and there is Chinese. I don't know which Chinese. Um, and there is Spanish and German, I think. And there was another. Oh, fuck. <laughs> there was another. Uh... <laughs> I don't know if it's available in French. Uh, what's the. You know, the it's a really common language. Uh, it's one of the. Uh, Spanish adjacent. I hope that's not offensive to say. Um, what is it? What is it? What is it? It's super common. A lot of people speak it. Portuguese, I think, maybe. Fuck. I think- No! 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 I think the emphasis is available in Portuguese. <laughs> I should have used I should have used, used the baby fireball. <laughs> There's no need to get all worked up, Gilio. Shame on you. No. You should not shame anyone for expressing their feelings. Even if it's uh, in a weird, kinda stupid, embarrassing way. Because feelings are feelings and you cannot control them. Though I think it would be more productive to say, um, or at least be in the mindset of uh, never judging anyone for their feelings, uh, but you should not just let anyone do whatever they want because of their feelings. So, the perfect thing to say would be, uh, fuck you, Jojo, for making stupid noises. I lost my train of thought, I'm sorry. <laughs> I ad-libbed that part. <laughs> yes. Could you imagine if you could convert like the Neo points you get in this game and like transfer them to your Neopets account? <laughs> Wait, I said Neopoints, right? Not Neopets. <laughs> you know what? I should play after this. The stupid Nintendo... Uh, Nintendo, whoa. The stupid Neopets... Otello game. Neopets... Puzzle Quest? Why is everything a quest? Have you thought about that too? Have we, like... Half? Half of like all the Neopets spin off games have quests in the title. <laughs> there's Neopets Codestone Quest, which is this game. Then there's Neopets Puzzle Quest, which is the Othello type game. Then there's Neopets Quintaris Quest, which was like an educational kids game for the leapfrog. Why there's so I guess quests are a very like Neopets esque thing because you do quests on Neopets. Hidden Hut. Are you sure? There's like a road right here. Is it really? Well, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. Uh... <laughs> I shouldn't scrutinize the right Neo quest. Yes. A key quest. Everything's a fucking quest on Neopets. <laughs> Fuck! It was blue. I was gonna say I shouldn't scrutinize the logic of this game and the naming conventions of the stages. Fuck. <laughs> Go away, stupid fairies. <laughs> well, I am rescuing them. Go away into the woods. Be free. <laughs> 
my 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 spine hurts from laughing. <laughs> oh, that was nice. That was kind of good. No, go away. Stop with the music. Stop it. Fuck. No. <laughs> Done with Mystery Island? We might be. Pew! Fuck. No way, it wasn't wrong. <laughs> hmm. I'm still a little bit sad about um, Neo Quest. Like, I was really excited to finally play Neo Quest because I've only like you know heard, known about it since. I was little, but never played it. I wish there was a way I could play it um, off-site, but then I wouldn't get the avatars anyway, so... <laughs> and I am very excited about the effects avatars. They're really fun to collect. But one day, one day, I think we'll play it for real. <laughs> If uh, NeoQuest ever gets added to Modern, uh, I will for sure ask if I can stream it. <laughs> no, damn it! <laughs> Power beam! Fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> damn you! Myself, I guess, because I was the one missed. <laughs> Nah, I'll blame it on Balthasar. Damn you, Balthasar! You made me miss! Because you're the one who's making me do this! Maybe... I guess the fairies are making us do it? Balthasar's a fault! And if Balthasar wasn't here, then the fairies wouldn't ask us to do this! Because he wouldn't be capturing the fairies! No, no, don't miss. Uh, <laughs> did you hear the music for like two seconds and then they get too close? <laughs> Go away. I suddenly have the Daytona. Like the game, the Daytona game. That's a really good game. I have it on PS3. <laughs> Cause PS3, PS3 can, like they, on the PS3 they sell some PS1 games. And that's one of them. Daytona. Uh, I'll just fireball them. <laughs> You save me some of the stress. Haha! <laughs> Feel the wrath of my fairy beam. Go! <laughs> oh my god, the music. Yes! We get to keep the music. <laughs> Why would you say that? Oh, right, because it sounded like a Jojo attack. <laughs> you know, I think it's pretty, um, pretty apparent that, that you know, Jojo is my actual name and not a Jojo reference, but I still get, like, um, people sometimes online. It's, like, I played, like, um, I'm not big on like playing online games with like random people. <laughs> there was one game I played, and it was like a kid walked up to me and was like, "What did he say?" It was like some JoJo reference. 
And I was just like, no, it's just my name. <laughs> so, to be completely fair, I have watched a fair bit of Yoda. And read a little bit of it, too. But it's been a while, it's been a while. Ooh, that's a that's an interesting one. <laughs> so, I'll set the scene, yeah? Imagine. You're me. At like 12 or something years old. I just watched the premiere of Wendy Wu on the Disney Channel. Mm -hmm. I remembered um, some kids at school were talking about this one online game. That's on one of our like, um, like public like television, um, uh, like state-run television websites. So it was funded by the state. It's an online game for teens. You can play as a little dog, and it's called the Dog Park in Swedish. So it's Hund Parken. HP. Yes. HP. That's where HP comes from. Hund Parken. Dog Park. Hund Parken. HP. But, oh my, I need a name for the dog I'm gonna play as. Hmm. Oh hey, I just watched a really cool Disney movie called Wendy Wu. Maybe I'll name my dog Wendy. Fuck, Wendy is taken. Wendy with an I is taken too. How about I add a cool C at the end? Wendy's! Ah, oh, so cool! There you go. <laughs> because Wendy's is taken on a lot of sites. So then I added HP for the dog park. The dog park initials <laughs> at the start. And that's where HP Wendy's comes from. And that's the story. Oh yes, you can tell it to your grandkids now. Yeah, it's just, it's just an online handle. <laughs> I, uh... I almost, like... Uh, on certain sites, I've been, like, quick enough. Yeah, yeah, it's a story. It's a story for the ages. Did I already say that? <laughs> on some sites, I've been quick enough to get just the Wendy's username. And don't have to add the HP. But uh, not on Twitch, no no. <laughs> not on Twitch, uh, not on Twitter. But other than that, pretty much like every site I use, I have Wendy's. It's just it really for it, like it really popular ones. Twitch and uh, Twitter. Yeah. So then instead of instead of going the Wendy's way, I try to rebrand it and make HP Wendy's into uh, my more like like public stuff and then I use Wendy's or Jojo for more like private stuff like my Tumblr like <laughs> my Tumblr is just uh, any person like it's just it's not like a promo Tumblr or anything it's just me so I don't use HP Wendy's as my Tumblr, but I have it. I use it as my art Tumblr, so that's some kind of connection there. <laughs> I have a little card that has like all of my HP Wendy's links, which has, which has my art or my streams from the videos. In my head, it makes sense. Um, <laughs> it's a bit debatable, but you know. <laughs> I try my best to make it like kind of uniform <laughs> and easy to find and understand. <laughs> it's confusing. Jojo is often like even harder to, to get on sites. Cause it's just like there's a lot of people named Jojo with just one J, so you can just add another J and it's like as good as Jojo, you know. <laughs> It is a pretty common nickname in Sweden, Jojo with two J's. It's actually pronounced different too, we don't pronounce it Jojo. <laughs> ah. No. Hmm. 
No. Fuck. <laughs> I wonder what the next land is gonna be. Maybe... Hmm, what would be like a natural progression? So we went from Neopia Central. Or was it Meridel? We went from Meridel. Maybe. <laughs> to Maraqua. So we went under the sea. And then we went up again. Fuck. <laughs> then we went up again. To Mystery Island. Maybe... What would be close? I guess Fairyland would be the closest, but I don't feel like we would go to Fairyland yet because of the fairy theming in this game. That feels like an end, end stage kind of thing, doesn't it? So, maybe either Terra Mountain, fuck, fuck, damn it, Terra Mountain, or Haunted Woods, and then Tyrannia. That's my, um,. That's my lock. That's a. Uh, that's my bet. And I'm probably gonna be wrong about it, and we're gonna go to Tyrannia. Fuck no! I'm uh. Let the music go away. It's gonna come back. <laughs> Neo Pets Codestone Quest mod removes stressful music. You know, if you get really tired of just the music in general in this game, since it's only like two songs, um, I could just turn the music off, keep the sound effects, play the uh, Nintendo Halloween music. <laughs> it's too late to do that today though, but um, <laughs> if necessary, I can do that. <laughs> to make the stream a little less like grating. <laughs> But, you know, two hours, it's, it's not that much. Yeah. It won't kill us. <laughs> There's the yellow one. Phew! No! No! I'm thinking a little bit about the Neopets mobile games again. There was like one screenshot of the Max Fairy game, or well, it wasn't really a screenshot, it was more like uh, it was a little like mock up with like. I guess it was like a bit of a screenshot. Like, they used. A little section of the screenshot and put no. <laughs> they put an NPC apparently from the game there, and it's like a Shoru with a turban, which is a bit strange. Ah. Go! Yes! This is the last one, please be the last one. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I don't know why you, why you, uh, I don't know why you said that, Jojo. We still have more levels to go. It's not the last one. It's not time to stop just yet. <laughs> Color blast! No! Oh! I saw a guy on YouTube who did a little like Neopets series where he uh, his plan was to play all of the Neopets Flash games. Then we had to stop because uh, Flash got cheated deleted. <laughs> it was a really good series. He's called uh, Tamago and with some numbers at the end. Uh, it's a really funny uh, YouTube series. I recommend it, you should go check it out. Um, it's also done like, I think, Club Penguin stuff, but I haven't watched it really. 
But yeah, his Nagofa series is really funny. <laughs> Yeah, I was thinking about, um... 100% accuracy, yes! I need to sneeze. Oh god. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. No, there's a stage left. I thought this was the last one. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Lost path. Um... Yes, yes. Neo for Flash Games. Could be um, an okay idea. <laughs> it's a more like it's a better idea for a YouTube series. That's what I was like trying to get at. Like it worked really well as a YouTube series because uh, like the way he did it worked out super well. It's a really fun, entertaining series. Dang it! <laughs> hmm. But yeah, I might, uh... <laughs> I might play the stupid... I might play, uh... Neopet's Puzzle Quest eventually on stream. <laughs> it's, uh... One of the games that made me sick once. I think it's about to. It's just, I was already sick. Like that's all I remember from that game. I was I was I had like a cold and I had a fever. And I usually play games when I when I feel sick and I can't sleep. So I picked Neopets Puzzle Quest. And ended up with a migraine <laughs> and ended up feeling even more sick than before. <laughs> And that's the only, like, clear memory I have of that game. <laughs> I think I was playing it either on my laptop or my DS. <laughs> I don't really remember. But it's just Othello, I think. Uh, it's got some Neopets characters. The art is kinda horrifying. <laughs> but uh, at least that game actually gave you stuff on the real site. Um, you can get some codes and stuff. I think the... Uh, like, Capcom made it, and the site is still up, which is really interesting. Like, I found that out a few weeks ago, because I was looking for, like, obscure, like, Neopet stuff online, and Capcom still has that site up. <laughs> the Neopet Puzzle Quest, like, landing page on the Capcom website. <laughs> Like it's not it's not part of the Kafka website. They used use the same host. I should bring that up before I stop today. I mean, I should stop after this. I guess we'll find out about the next land. Um, no, we can't find out what the next land is, but then we'll check it out next stream. <laughs> yeah, I wanna I wanna um, I wanna show the weird page on stream. <laughs> it's just interesting. Yeah, it's not much to see, really, but it's um, it's a bit of internet archaeology, I guess. <laughs> it's weird, yeah. No, <laughs> why did I think that was gonna work? <laughs> you gotta appreciate the like uh, strange things in life, you know. Whether it be. Uh, a weird animal you saw once, or a, a dead website for a dead game. Pew! I don't. There was a site theme for it, like, um, that you got from playing that game, I think, but I don't have it, I think. <laughs> on my new pets account, even though I have played the game. I think you ne needed to like complete the game maybe or reach a certain point and I never completed it so... And you can't uh, redeem the codes anymore, unfortunately. I turned that off when Jumpstart bought new pets I think. Like a lot of those like code redeeming things on site was were turned off. 
for one reason or, or another. I guess they didn't have the rights. To like, uh... It, like, there must be something there. Like, they can't, like, encourage people to buy the plush toys. They, they don't have the rights to, to like, talk about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm just guessing. Woohoo! Trying to uh, not uh, like I'm trying really hard um, not to forget the site. Puzzle quest site. Puzzle quest site. It's not much, but it's a puzzle quest site. <laughs> Karaoke stream when. Reese's Puffs, Reese's Puffs! Eat em up, eat em up, eat em up! I don't remember how many eat em ups there are. <laughs> Is it three or four? <laughs> Boom! No! Yes! Apparently, um... I found... <laughs> On a NeoQuest stream, that there are NeoPets songs with lyrics in them. <laughs> They're really bad. Um, so <laughs> I was just thinking, like, why could you like? <laughs> Is there a single NeoPet song you could have a karaoke version of? Not really. <laughs> but then I remember that both exist. <laughs> No, never in a million years will I have a karaoke stream. <laughs> You'll have to go to the uh, VTubers for that. Yeah, VTubers. <laughs> is it just me or is this stage like... Going on forever, honestly? <laughs> I thought it was gonna be done before... Uh, uh, four, but now it's one minute past. <laughs> I had to look at the clock. No, 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 I thought it was yellow. Mellow yellow. This has to be the last one, honestly. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit tired of the stage. <laughs> oh, it is. Oh, and it's kind of short, too. Okay, let's go fast. Let's go quick and fast and finish the stage. And I messed up. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have gone fast. <laughs> You know, time flies when you talk about like cartoons and neopets and weird sites and name origins and uh, what were some of the other things we talked about today? I already said cartoons. Movies, I guess? <laughs> YouTube series and... Uh, uh, I don't know. We're done. <laughs> we're done! Yay! Let me sit up, actually. <laughs> yes! We are done with Mystery Island, I think! Woohoo! Yay! It's still weird that it's just completely quiet when you finish. <laughs> like a land. land. We're almost, almost halfway through. We didn't get any lore! I guess we get the lore when we get to the next next part. It's Lost Desert, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so at least it wasn't Tyrannia, so I didn't completely clown myself, but I, do, I don't even think I mentioned Lost Desert. Should I click on it? Should we- I think- I feel like we deserve some lore today, like some more lore, come on, why not? You really have to- okay, never mind. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I don't want to start an another stage, so I think we're good. <laughs> 
I didn't mean to make all those sounds. I <laughs> I shocked. <laughs> What is this? Wait, it's telling me I don't have any achievements? What does this mean? 14%? <laughs> this is very confusing. Maybe it's maybe I have to click change profile. No. No, that didn't do anything. I was thinking maybe it needs to be updated. Yeah, th these stats are just confusing. <laughs> See, look at all these achievements! Wow! Wait, wait. Oh! Do you see this one? Oh my god. Complete entire game without using a pet pet. That was an achievement! Well, we're not gonna 100% this game. <laughs> we probably had to play the game on hard anyway if we wanted to 100% complete it. <laughs> Let me see if I can find the Capcom thing. Let me actually let's play this music. That's kind of low. That's okay. Capcom. That's possible. Request. Oh. Oh, it's called Possible Adventure, really? I've been saying it wrong this entire time. Yeah, it was Possible Adventure. Look, it's still up! <laughs> and there's supposed to be a trailer here, probably. Like, I can't even post it in chat. <laughs> yeah, wow. Your streamer that you looked up to so much. Is that a wrong thing, dude? Misinformation. Mm, I think you might have to cancel your favorite streamer. Ah, yeah, I know. It's kind of hard to say. Yeah, it can hurt, but uh, you know, they, they messed up. They messed up. Cannot be forgiven. I'm gonna go back to the setup screen. <laughs> but we are not setting up. Click! <laughs> we are quitting. Yup. We're quitting for today. We made some really good progress! We made some really good progress on Code Sun Quest. Um, let's see. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. Decent. Oh, come on. <laughs> I think we made good progress. In my very humble opinion. Let me. I want to know. Uh, oh. Uh, right, I don't. It's fine. <laughs> Clam. Man. Toe. We need to get it. Look, I can go back to custom quests to see. Look. Glam. Man. Do. This is the prologue, apparently. I know! <laughs> so they either released this last year, in June. So this we can get for free. Yeah, it exists! They weren't kidding about Clema 2. <laughs> so I'm definitely adding this to my wish list. So we gotta play it, we gotta play it. Maybe I'll look into playing it tomorrow, actually, and I'm really excited. <laughs> it seems like they're doing a different perspective, look. It's top down. Ow. I don't wanna, I don't wanna get spoiled. <laughs> Oh, so exciting. Clam man! Look at that. Oh my god, look at them. <laughs> you can lie to a child. Okay, okay, let's... <laughs> let's go down. Let's go down. We will play Clam Man open mic. We will play it. And then we'll have to keep our eyes open after... Uh, or I eyes open for Clam Man 2. That's what I wanted to say. <laughs> Clam Man. <laughs> I'll download it and uh, and see. I also want to play Wilmot. Uh, but those are like the only games you're playing now, right? Wilmot and Neopets. 
So we can squeeze in some clam and open my key. <laughs> Maybe it's just... Uh, we'll see. I don't know how... Since it's just a prologue, it might be really short, so I might do a dual stream with some clam man and some Wilmot. <laughs> There's always room for clam! Yes! Isn't that the truth? Alright, that's enough for today. See you tomorrow or Friday. Hopefully with some clam man. We'll see, we'll see. Bye bye for now. Bye bye bye. Have a spooky rest of your day. Ooh -hoo, spooky Halloween time. Bye bye bye. See ya. Ooh.